All right, guys, so yesterday, things got shaken up a little bit at Top Notch Lawns. Uh, and what I mean by that is Hunter and Zach are no longer working for this company. Uh, ultimately, it was their decision, but uh, I, think it was, I think it's probably best for both parties that this happened. Uh, and it's not all their fault, it's not my fault. It's, things just didn't work out. And uh, I need somebody, I need some people that uh, are gonna be uh, more reliable and uh, their other job didn't allow them to be as reliable as I, I want them to be. So uh, they both decided that it was best that they uh, go a different way. So, and I would agree with them, uh, but it was fun, it was real. Uh, we had good times, but Top Notch Lawns must move on. So you guys might be asking yourself what I just did. Here's the deal. I got to do this whole street here, okay? Both sides. From the, from the first house we just seen to the two houses that are facing us down there at the end. And uh, since I'm by myself now, uh, at least for the time being, uh, I have to do things a little bit differently because I have to do everything now. So, Sorry about the shadow, but here's the deal, okay? I probably got about, I'm gonna say about two hours worth of weeding to do. And I know my trimmer will last about an hour with straight weed eating. So I put that at the very end, I already filled it up. I put my uh, deal at the very end, so that way when I get down to that street, get down to that point, I can fill up my gas again and then come back the next way so I don't run out of gas when I'm all the way down there and have to walk all the way back and all the way back down there to start again. So I got all these properties to do, the ones I just showed you. Uh, not sure how many of them there are. Uh, I think there's 15 or 20 of them. But uh, I got those to do, I got a, I got a mow, I got a weed eat, I got an edge, and I have to blow off, okay? It's gonna take me a while. Uh, I'm guessing probably five or six hours, and uh, you know, and I have I have a lot of other stuff to do. I'm way behind because the boys didn't show up yesterday, and uh, so it's on me now. It's on me. I gotta get it done. I have to work late. I have to take the time away from the things that I had planned. Well, with my family, and. Uh, you know, and get, get, try to get this stuff done. Try to get as much done as I can. Uh, I did promise my kids we're going swimming tonight. That is not going to change. We're going swimming. They've been wanting to go swimming for about a week now. It's going to happen. So I owe that to them. And uh, we're going to go have some fun. But I, I got to get, get going. I'm going to record as much as I can. I'm going to edge first. Then I'm going to weed eat. Then I'm going to, then I'm going to mow. Okay. And uh, especially when I'm working by myself, I like to get the hard stuff out of the way, get done. I just, I just feel better. You know, I don't like waiting until the end to weed eat for two hours. Not, not, not fun. So I like to get it, get it first thing when I'm fresh. And uh, then when I'm tired, a little bit tired from weed eating and edging, I can sit on the mower for a little bit. So that's my plan. I'm gonna try to record a little bit for you.
All right, so just got done edging. Wasn't too bad. That grass is pretty thick. We didn't uh, we didn't edge here last week because of the uh, the rain and being behind. So uh, had some extra growth to it for sure. But I ain't even mixed my water yet. Today I got the uh, going with the orange. I haven't tried the orange yet. So we're gonna go with the orange. So that took me right around an hour and 15 minutes. Not too bad for edging. This is what I was talking about when I was talking about stick edger versus trim edger. Normal properties, guys, you probably you're probably faster off using the trimmer if you can get away with it. But something this big, when you're doing a lot of these properties like this and just a big, big commercial properties, I'm telling you, man, I would have been. I'd have been so wore out after using a trimmer if I was good at it, because I'm not. But even if I was, that's just a lot to edge. Sidewalks, driveways, all those have sidewalks, so it's a lot. Let's test out this orange. That's pretty good. It's actually really good. I like it. So now I'm gonna start. Uh, now I'm gonna start weeding. So I'm actually pretty curious to see how long this takes me. It takes me more than two hours, and uh, my gas can down there is not gonna work very well because <laughs> I'll probably run out somewhere back around the truck, and I'll have to walk back down there and get it. But. I guess I better hustle, make sure I get it down two hours. Cause the uh, gas tank, you know, on these weed eaters, I've, you know, cause I do this a lot. They last right about an hour, give or take five minutes or so. But they last about an hour. So anyway, let's get started. Just got done with him. I'm telling you, I got that down pat. Took right at two hours. I ran out of gas. My gas can's all the way down to the other end of the block. But all I had left was that mailbox and just a little spot up there in the front front corner. And uh, so I timed it perfectly. When I got down there, uh, I was pretty close to being out too. So couldn't have planned that any better. It took just a little bit over two hours, like two hours and 15 minutes. Um, that wore me out, I ain't gonna lie. That's the legs of somebody that we needs in shorts. All right guys, so this is, uh, this is one of the last houses I had to mow. 
Uh, by this time, I'm pretty exhausted. Uh, this day was pretty hard for me. It's a lot of stuff to do for one man. But, uh, you know, I got it done. No big deal. And I'll do it again if I have to. Uh, you know, that's the way uh, that's the way this business works. You will go in and out of employees. Uh, this is nobody's dream job to come help people mow. Uh, that's why, you know, I try to make my... Uh, try to make my guys have as much fun as we can. Uh, YouTube has definitely uh, made that a possibility. You know, I thought I was a pretty uh, pretty good boss. Uh, rarely rarely got onto, onto those boys. They, they did a pretty good job most of the time. I thought I was pretty lenient on, uh, you know, time and letting them have days off and stuff like that. But, uh, you know, it is what it is, and uh, I appreciate their efforts. I really do. They did a lot for me outside of uh, outside of uh, you know lawn care. They did a lot of extra stuff, and uh, you know, and I appreciate it. You know, but at the end of the day, I'm trying to run a company here, and uh, you know, the 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 times that they don't show up is the times that uh, now I have to work late, and I don't like doing that anymore. I'm not going to sacrifice my free time to make a little bit of extra money. Uh, at, at the beginning of the year, that was kind of my goal, to make as much as I can, and do this and do that, but it's not worth it, man. I, I, miss, I miss spending time with my kids. I miss uh, spending time with my wife, and uh, we were struggling there for a while just because, uh, you know, it's a, it's, it's a time issue, and uh, I'm not going to do it no more. So. I'm gonna try to get some new help in. I'm gonna try to get some guys that uh, I know will show up every day, and uh, we're gonna go from there. Uh, this is not gonna be a setback for me. I will be better for this, and my company will be better better for this, and uh, I will bring you guys along with it. So I appreciate you guys watching.